In a world that is becoming more focused on sustainability, the automotive industry has been under immense pressure to shift toward cleaner and more energy efficient technologies. Electric vehicles have been at the forefront of this transformation, offering an alternative to gasoline-powered cars that release harmful emissions. However, even AVs still come with major challenges, including range anxiety, long charging times, and dependency on external power grids. But what if a car didn't need a charging station or any connection to the power grid? What if it could continuously generate its own energy while in motion, harvesting power from its environment? <laughs> Introducing the Maxwell Chukambutso self-powered car, a groundbreaking innovation that has the potential to transform personal transportation. This revolutionary vehicle, designed by the brilliant Zimbabwean engineer Maxwell Chikambutso, stands at the forefront of a new era in sustainable mobility. Unlike traditional cars, it does not rely on external charging stations because it generates its own power through advanced energy harvesting technologies. This innovation could eliminate the need for external power sources entirely. <laughs> but how far can a self-powered car really go? What is the true range of a vehicle that powers itself? To fully grasp the significance of this breakthrough, let's take a deep dive into the technology behind it, examine the numbers, and explore how this could reshape the future of travel. Imagine driving a vehicle that sustains itself on the road, no more waiting at charging stations or worrying about running out of power. The Maxwell Chikambutso self-powered car turns this vision into a reality, pushing past the conventional limitations of electric vehicles by utilizing multiple energy sources to generate power. The design of this vehicle incorporates cutting-edge technologies, including solar panels, wind turbines, and the ability to convert kinetic energy into electricity. Maxwell Chikambutso, an electrical engineer, inventor, and entrepreneur, is the mastermind behind this remarkable self-powered car. Known for his pioneering work in energy technology, Chikambutso has developed numerous innovations that harvest energy from the environment, including energy-efficient generators that make use of ambient power sources. His ultimate mission has always been to create groundbreaking solutions that reduce dependence on traditional energy supplies and move the world toward a more sustainable future. This self-powered car represents the realization of that goal, standing as a revolutionary advancement in the automotive industry. While the idea of a car that powers itself might sound like something out of science fiction, the technology backing Chikambutsa's invention is firmly based on real-world scientific principles. With the increasing push for sustainable transportation, this vehicle exemplifies what can be achieved when innovation and technology come together. But how exactly does it work, and what kind of performance can be expected from it? At its core, the self-powered car is built around the principle of independent energy generation. Unlike traditional electric vehicles that require external power sources such as charging stations or electricity grids, the Maxwell Chikambutso self-powered car integrates multiple systems that allow it to extract and store energy as it moves. The vehicle incorporates several advanced technologies that function together to produce and manage power. One of these is solar panels, which are seamlessly embedded into the body of the car. These panels capture sunlight and convert it into electricity, which can be used to power the vehicle's systems or charge its battery. Additionally, the car is equipped with small wind turbines that take advantage of wind energy while driving. These turbines convert kinetic energy from the air into usable electricity, particularly when the car is moving at higher speeds. Another key component of this system is kinetic energy recovery. Similar to the regenerative braking systems found in electric cars, the self-powered vehicle captures and reuses energy produced during braking and deceleration. This energy is then stored in the car's battery and used to keep the vehicle running. Together, these technologies ensure that the car can generate and store power without ever needing to be plugged into an external charging station. Efficient energy storage is also critical to this system. The vehicle's battery management system, BMS, optimizes how energy from solar, wind, and kinetic sources is collected and distributed to maximize efficiency. 
While the idea of a self-sustaining car is revolutionary, it does come with certain efficiency challenges. The amount of energy the car can generate depends on external factors such as the intensity of sunlight and wind. Consequently, energy production will vary depending on weather conditions, location, and time of day. For instance, driving at night or in areas with little sunlight reduces the effectiveness of solar panels. Similarly, wind turbines perform best at higher speeds, meaning they are more effective on highways than in stop-and-go city traffic. However, despite these challenges, the car is designed to ensure that the energy collected is enough to power most of its essential functions. In ideal conditions, the vehicle could potentially sustain itself without any external charging. The ultimate measure of a self-powered vehicle's success is its real-world range. How far can it travel without an external power source? To answer this, testing the Maxwell Chikambutso self-powered car under various driving conditions provides key insights. In city environments, the car primarily relies on energy recovered from braking and the continuous input from its solar panels. Since urban driving involves frequent stops and starts, the energy harvested from wind turbines is less significant. However, the car still benefits from kinetic energy recovery, extending its operational range. Initial tests show that in these conditions, the car can travel between 200 to 300 miles on a full charge, with energy harvesting technologies boosting this range by an additional 10 to 20 percent. On highways, the car performs much more efficiently due to constant movement, allowing the wind turbines to generate more power. This advantage significantly enhances overall efficiency. During high-speed driving tests, the self-powered car demonstrated a range increase of up to 50 percent, with some test runs exceeding 400 miles before requiring external charging. In off-road conditions, the vehicle's energy harvesting systems continued to function well. The kinetic energy recovery system proved especially useful on rugged terrain, particularly when navigating inclines or uneven surfaces. While wind turbine effectiveness was reduced due to lower speeds, the solar panels continued to provide steady power, contributing to overall energy efficiency. In off-road settings, the car maintained a range of approximately 150 to 200 miles before requiring external charging. Comparing this real-world performance to conventional vehicles, the results are impressive. Gasoline-powered cars typically travel between 300 and 400 miles per tank, depending on fuel efficiency. Meanwhile, most electric cars offer a range between 200 and 300 and 350 miles per charge. The Maxwell Chikambutso self-powered car falls within a similar range as many electric vehicles with the added benefit of energy self-sufficiency. Since it continuously generates and stores power while driving, it can extend its range without external charging, an advantage for those in regions with limited charging infrastructure. Despite its promise, there are challenges that must be addressed before self-powered cars become widespread. One concern is the initial cost. Due to the advanced technology used, these vehicles may come with a higher price tag, though costs are expected to decrease as the technology advances. Another challenge is charging time. While the self-powered car generates power on the move, fully recharging a drained battery still requires time. Future developments may help optimize this process. Additionally, reliance on solar and wind energy means that the car's efficiency is affected by weather conditions, but improvements in energy storage could help offset this issue. The Maxwell Chikambutso self-powered car provides a glimpse into the future of sustainable transportation. <laughs> if this technology is refined and scaled, it could significantly reduce global dependence on fossil fuels, lower carbon emissions, and make personal transportation more energy efficient. It may serve as the foundation for a new era in automotive technology, one where vehicles generate and store their own energy, minimizing the need for external charging and fuel consumption. If widely adopted, this breakthrough could drastically reduce the environmental footprint of the automotive industry. The real-world performance of the Maxwell Chikambutso self-powered car presence an exciting outlook for the future of mobility. While there are still obstacles to overcome, the potential for self-powered vehicles to revolutionize transportation and energy consumption is undeniable. 
As advancements continue, this innovation could provide a viable alternative to both traditional gasoline cars and conventional electric vehicles, paving the way for a cleaner, more efficient future for all.